everybody, welcome back to another Crystal's Cooking Kitchen! If you don't already know who I am, then uh, I literally just said my name like a few seconds ago. It's President's Day tomorrow, and what better way to celebrate President's Day with a mac and cheese pot pie? Yup, you heard me, mac and cheese pot pie. Because what is more American than mac and cheese? What is more American than combining stuff to make other stuff. Did that make sense? Anyways, for this video I will be using a recipe that, again, I got off of Facebook. But it's a familiar account. I got it from Tasty. <laughs> Let's get started with what you're gonna need. Milk! And I got lactose free because it was the cheapest that they had. Elbow noodles or macaroni. Some cheese. More cheese. You know what? Just get all the cheese that you can find. Butter, stick form or not, I really don't know. Some salt and some pepper. Some garlic powder and Italian seasoning. Pizza dough, which I happen to get in a can because I want to make my life easy. And stuff you're going to use to cook. Well, that was a lot of ingredients, which brings up the question, will I fail or will I prevail? First step is to, what the frick I keep the first step is to preheat your oven to 350. How do you, okay, it's preheating. Gotcha. Okay, wow, we're already in this position. Am I gonna be able to do this? I hope so, because I spent my money on milk and cheese. Two cups of milk. Oh, it's not even open. Ew. One cup. Two cups. Perfect. We're we're cooking now. Two cups of elbow noodles. Or as we like to call it, macaroni. One tablespoon of salt. Why didn't I just open it and pour it? I don't know. One tablespoon of salt. And two teaspoons of pepper. What the frick? I can't open it. That looks like a lot of pepper. But it says, so I'm gonna do it. And now you have to put everything to a boil. What do I stir with? I don't know, what are they stirring with? A wooden spoon! Frick! It looks like a lot of pepper. Two teaspoons, two teaspoons. I did that. Does it freaking look like this? Guys, I really want this to work. I just, I really like mac and cheese. Why is cooking so hard? I'll be right back when it starts to boil. You know guys, I really am not the cook of my family. I just suck at cooking, okay? Ask me to make you a cup of noodles. Sure, why not? Ask, ask me to make you an omelet. Sure, why not, I guess. Ask me to toast you some kind of sausage. Yeah, I could do that. I just can't cook. I don't know why. I'm just gonna assume that this is boiling. And now I have to wait until like the liquid is evaporated halfway and then I'm gonna add another cup of milk. Guys, so I think it's been uh, boiled half well, yeah, so I'm gonna add another. <laughs> I really can't speak English, oh my gosh. It says, stir until pasta is al dente, al dente, al dente. I don't know what al dente is. God help me. I searched up what al dente means, and it means a food, typically pasta, cooked so as to be firm when bitten. So the pasta, I stabbed it with the spoon and it did not feel firm. Okay, can someone tell me why this isn't looking like the video? It's like, the pasta isn't al dente, and the milk is almost gone. What's happening? I followed the instructions. I followed everything, and it is not working. Ow! I just want mac and cheese. I can't even cook mac and cheese. Okay, guys, uh, things are not working out. The freaking milk is gone. The pasta isn't even cooked right. I added more milk. What is going on? Milk? Is this not one cup? It says one cup right there. And did I boil it for too long? Is it too hot? I can't even freaking cook my uh. I'm gonna add the cheese now before anything else goes wrong. Oh my gosh, that is so cheesy. Look at that. Oh my goodness. 
Honestly, that's not bad, I guess. The oven has been preheated for the longest time now, but now I'm just gonna prepare the dang pie. Yep, I said to butter it. And then it says to like layer it with cheese or something, I don't know. Where's the opening? Oh, there it is. Cheese, cheese. I'm so disappointed with myself. Stupid mac and cheese. Can't even cook mac and cheese. Why am I such a failure? And here we go. There it is. Does that look like too much? I freaking know what too much looks like. Because I guess I put too much pepper! Make that butter thing that they put on top of this thing first. It smells like garlic. No, no kidding. Teaspoon of salt. Where's the salt? Teaspoon of Italian seasoning. Perfect. So I don't have that thing that they use to spread the thing on, so I'm using this spatula. Did I not melt enough butter? That looks disgusting. We most likely did not melt enough butter because what is that? This what? Well, I'm melting more butter. Okay, great. That looks more normal, I guess. How do you open this? Ah! <laughs> you spread it out again. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. So much hard work. It's beautiful. I'm so good at cooking. Well, no, not really, but ugh. This is good enough. That is looking gross. I should open a restaurant. Did you go to it? No? Uh, I wouldn't either. Okay, well, now I'm gonna put the pie in the oven and I'm wearing oven mitts because I freaking don't like ovens. Big for 25 minutes. So there it is. Wow. Hot pies you're supposed to like flip over. I don't know I'm gonna do that. <gasps> it came out. Yeah, okay, okay. Okay? Okay. Let's not get too excited. Holy crap. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, this is it guys. This is a freaking pot pie. A uh hot. -huh. Tastes like mac and cheese and bread. So, follow me on my social media to see the other side of my life. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, share the video if you want. Watch my other videos if you're interested in that. Uh, what else is there to say? Well, I'm Crystal Bernardo and I suck at cooking. Gosh.